Hi everyone, um, I've just had my Hermes man here with my scrimpy delivery, so I'm just going to show you what I got. And I've got my wee card. Oh, good lover. To Karen, thank you for your order, hugs Amanda. How cute is that? Well, we have precious moments on it. And she's added in one of the wee beautiful ballerinas, which is getting hoarded forever. Right. Now I've got a big, big order, so. I'll just unpack because I've got two kits in here. That's one kit. That's the second kit. Right. I'll do the kits actually in a separate video because there is a lot of them. Um, I got these, which are the small um, organza flowers um, with the wee diamante in it, and the, the stick-on ones. I'm going to just widen this a wee bit so I can see what I'm doing. So that's in there. This lighting's absolutely rubbish. Because it's going to take me probably about half an hour to get these done, never mind adding on the kit. Then I've got, I can't remember if I bought two sets of these or if it was just the one. I'm videoing, going up and give it a wipe. If it's still sore, you can stay in for a wee while. Um, it's the wee faceted um, ruby coloured gemstones. Going out and play. Okay. Hurry up, darling, please. Okay. Good man. I got the six millimeter flat back pedal trim, which is stunning, and I use loads of it. I got muslin I'll just see if it's still on it. Um, I think it was just the one I got over. It might be two. But it's just the uh, natural cheesecloth muslin. And I use this a lot for flowers and um, like wall hangings to make um, the fraying on them and things. I've got this white trim braiding and it's got the iridescent trim through it. I'll try and see if I can pick that up. 
think you're just catching it. But there's an iridescent threading through it. It was a metre of that I got. I think this is two or three metres of this one and it's the ivory goupier lace. It's so pretty. And then we've got Amanda's Jellyfish Lease, <laughs> which is just beautiful. Its dangle is fantastic. Just so elegant and pretty. I then got this one. Quite thick that one with a dangle on it. So it's really pretty. That's lovely for see if you're doing a miniature canvas and putting that on with like a couple of diamantes in the corner. It just finishes it beautifully. And then we'll get this one. This is a pleex. And it's a double layer pleex. It's so pretty. Let's see if I can tilt you down a bit and see if that comes up better. No. Just going to annoy me. That's a bit better actually. And then you've got the double layer, it's two flowers, so it's lovely. And I mean, you can actually trim round the flowers if you wish and use just the flower applique on its own and then use the extra of the applique on different canvases and things. Then I've got this trim here which I have had um, previously, but I think it was white or a lighter cream. This is more like um, a golden ivory colour. It's not coming up colour-wise great on this. But it's stunning. And it's actually got a sheen off it. Oh my god. Just this one glued this Amanda. There you have. That's so I get to enjoy it a wee bit longer. <laughs> Put it in there. Right, I've got this pink. It's time for my hair bow. Um time of year. Coming up to the summer holidays. Um, and the kids come back to school, I get quite a rush. Um, so I tend to buy in quite a lot of ribbon at this time of year for that. And this is one that Amanda was selling that's um, an iridescent one again. Pink iridescent. Absolutely stunning. And I think there's two or three metres on it, I can't remember. I then got this beautiful embroidered tool and that's a hard one for a bit absolutely stunning then we've got the floral um hessian type ribbon. It is fabulous for working with. 
um, and it makes lovely flowers. Um, and the same with this one, this is the vintage um, butterfly trim. Um, and again, you can make gorgeous flowers with this. It's wired, so you don't even need to sew. Just cut the length that you need for a flower, pull one wire out, and the other wire pull really tightly, and then screw it together. And just a tiny wee bit of tack and glue between the two ends, and that's it. It's absolutely stunning. Then we've got the daisy trim, and I use this for my tacks in my bedroom, eh, my craft room. Just chop them off, tiny wee bit of glo glossy accents, and then put it onto the back of the tack. And it just takes a cheap gold colour away from it, and makes it just that wee bit nicer. Um, then we've got this one. Now, these aren't colours I would normally buy, if I'm honest. But I'm trying to go a bit more natural colours. And it's um, like a beige, bronzy colour, um, embroidered tulle, and it's lovely. So good quality. Um, and I'd imagine it makes absolutely stunning flowers, but I haven't used it yet. That's a new one for me. I haven't bought that one before. Then we've we'll got this one. This is one of my favourite laces that I get from Amanda. And it's the embroidered tulle. Beautiful for flowers, absolutely beautiful. If you take your tacking, your running stitch, just in every second, into, over to, into, over to, makes a lovely gather and it's 12 scallops, makes an absolutely stunning flower. Um, this is another new one for me that I haven't bought before or used before. Um, and it's the Hessian backed with the lace on top but I'm thinking for more masculine boxes I thought this would be quite nice because the lace on it isn't lacy lacy it is just one um, round it and I think it will look quite pretty and you can actually double that over and it actually makes it thinner um, and makes it look like a double layer. So that's another idea for it. Um, oh, come on. Then we've got this really wide lace. And it's again the um, beige bronzy colour. Absolutely stunning. The quality of it, honestly, I'm super impressed. Sometimes you get them and you, there's like catches. Um, there's nothing on this. Absolutely nothing. There's no flaws whatsoever. It's beautiful. Can't wait to use it. And this is a black sequined lace, absolutely gorgeous. And it's really elegant looking because um, the sequences aren't cheap sequences. They're um, really, really pretty and quite dignified. They're not in your face. Sometimes you get these sequenced laces and they're just 
otherwise that's really elegant looking. Jaden, I'm still filming, Darren, what is it now? See my film wheel, it's this stuff, it's what? Well, just bring your bike in, your dad will need to sort it after. Well, yeah, I don't know why she's... Just bring in the bike, please, I'm filming. <sighs> School holidays. Um, this is another sequenced braid. And it's an iridescent sequin, so it's not again in your face, it's just really, really elegant. And on a box or with um, a trim, with a lace under it, it'll be lovely. Jaden, just put it in the hall, please. I'll have a look at it later, please. Oh, they are lovely, Amanda. They are lovely. I got a couple of sets of these and um, they are just superb. Look at that, I'm not even going to open them properly. In fact, I'll open one. I get three sets of them. My hands are absolutely useless this morning. Absolutely stunning. Absolutely love them. They were a wee bit expensive. Um, that's why I only get six, but they are... When I'm saying they're expensive, they are expensive for Amanda to buy. Um, and she sells them as cheaply as she possibly can. But... As I said, they're a bit more expensive. They're the more um, exclusive ones that Amanda gets. She does buy in acrylic bling for us. Um, like the wee diamante gemstones I showed you at the beginning. The pinky coloured ones. They're great and they are really, really elegant. And they're not expensive. But the ones are the high quality and... Um, this is another lay uh, ribbon, Maxi. It's one of these days. Um, it's a white iridescent this time. I'm just trying to see if I can pick up the iridescence in it. I'm sure you can see that sparkling there. But again, that's just for my my girly hair bows. Um, then we've got this one here um this is let me see oh yeah this is the box chiffon with the, a pink chiffon with a white lace trim on top of it and again I'm thinking for um, the wee girl clasps if you think like that with a wee um, gemstone in the middle or a wee character the wee ones absolutely love it so that was why I bought that Um, then we've got this, and it's the pink um, embroidered chill. I buy the white all the time, but the pink one was up on, and I managed to get hold of it. And it's lovely. And I've got a lot of friends that like pink, so it's nice to have it um, in stock. Let's do it. Um, and I think this is the last one for my laces.
Um, and this is the um, Eyelet Lace um, Brodery Ongly. Um, and it's got the ribbon trail for the top. So you can weave in whatever ribbon you want. Perfect for babies' boxes. Um, put in your sky blue or your baby pink and it looks absolutely stunning then we've got this one here Max will you go and lie down please um, and again I will be chopping this down into small appliques for um, ideal for pocket letters ATCs cards um, Canvas is absolutely anything, but it's really nice. Right, put that there then out just to make sure I've shown everything there. Right, so it's just this one here, and it's a small um, bow lace, and it's just really pretty, goopy, and again, chop it down individually you can make it into um, small butterflies chop the bottom part off and then you don't go you've got butterfly wings there just try and think how you can get the most out of your laces um, I'm going to come back on and do the the kits because I'm at now 25 minutes nearly um, and no harm that's too long <laughs> but I like to show everything up close um, Amanda has got a new website which is www.scrimpyscraftboutique.co.uk if it's not .co.uk it's .com but I'm sure it's co.uk I will double check it and put it in the link down below um, and I'll be back in a few minutes to share with you my beautiful fabric kits alright thanks for watching speak to you soon bye for now